But here's an alarming trend. Police say 13 food delivery drivers have been robbed at gunpoint in Tampa since October. In one case, shots were fired. ABC Action News reporter Jacqueline Glaze rode along with officers to see what they're doing about this problem. Jacqueline? Well, Brendan, when detectives left headquarters here, they had with them a stack of flyers. On those flyers, tips for restaurant owners on how they can keep the drivers who bring the food to your door safe. Walking around delivering pizzas at night with a blue shirt that says, I carry cash. There were times where I was not too thrilled about the position I was in. Former pizza delivery driver Jay McGill knows delivering pizzas comes with a side of danger. There are areas that they don't deliver to after nightfall for that very reason, for drivers being robbed or shot. Since October, detectives told ABC Action News more than a dozen delivery drivers have been robbed at gunpoint. In a case here on East Emma Street, the suspect even opened fire on the driver. Three bullets lodging in the car as the driver's family sat inside. The disturbing trend is Tampa police taking to the streets tonight, warning restaurant owners and drivers, handing them this flyer full of safety tips, like not to carry more than $20 in change. It's a very disturbing and alarming trend. The crimes are taking place between 7 p.m. and 1 a.m. in both North and East Tampa. Sometimes the drivers are called out to abandoned houses or random intersections. Other times it's a legit order and the drivers are just targeted while on their way. It doesn't get much worse than that than to victimize someone who's trying to legitimately make a living. Despite similar descriptions given by drivers, police believe multiple suspects are behind the food orders. But for drivers who need to make a living, danger is now on the menu. A price McGill decided he wasn't willing to pay. It really boils down to situational awareness and how we feel about you know, where we're at. Uh, most of those who are out making deliveries who were robbed, well, they were too afraid to talk on camera tonight because there have not been any arrests in any of these cases. We're live tonight in downtown Tampa. Jacqueline Inglace, ABC Action News. Thank you, Jacqueline.